Hey real fans, finally, finally getting back with another video. I've uh, done a lot of work. Some of you might notice, some of you might not. So a list of things here that have been done in the room. First thing first, you might notice the room is painted. Um, my last layout, this was something I wanted to do. I did paint a backdrop on the last layout, but the other thing that I wanted to do badly was paint the ceiling black. And, <clears throat> excuse me, I never did get to do that on the old layout. It would have taken a lot of work and I got anxious to start laying track. I was afraid that if I painted or spray painted, I would get paint all over the layout, so I never did it. So I stopped what I was doing this time and got the ceiling painted. As you can see, it is totally black up there. So it kind of draws your eyes down to the layout. Secondly, I have fluorescent lights in here. And I found these shop lights at Menards. Yeah, you can see them. <laughs> LED shop lights for 30 bucks a piece. Good investment. It made this room much brighter. And I think they use less energy. I'm pretty sure I'm, I'm accurate on that. But I really like the way they lit the room up. So that's two things that were done. Third thing was the wiring underneath the layout. As you can tell, the track is pretty much the same. Um, a lot of things going on. I wasn't able to get as much done as I wanted. But I wanted to get a video out to let you guys know what I've been doing up to this point. Especially before uh, Christmas. Because who knows whether or not I'll be able to get something out before then. So I wanted to get this done. Uh, I've been working like crazy trying to get my uh, CTC board, which I will pan over this way so you can see it. This is what it looks like compared to the last time. Um, when I get it all completed to be mounted up here. One of the problems I've had, I got a wire wrong somewhere. As you can see, I got my uh, Zephyr, Digitrack Zephyr and an old power pack I was going to be able to switch from DC to DCC um, DCC is working DC is not so I'm gonna to have to do some troubleshooting figure out where I got a wire or two wrong I'll show you a train running here in a minute but the room's pretty sloppy right now I got stuff everywhere but you can see also I closed in my bulkhead the garage door opener is not showing anymore but these lights, man, I'm really happy about these lights. I even painted my speakers, if you can see that. The blend in up top. I'm really happy the way I ignore the television. Gotta watch basketball sometime while I'm working out here, but. Um, room's really coming together. Like you see, that's pretty trashed out right now. I got all my buildings down in the corner. Um, trying to think, was there something else I wanted to update you guys? Oh! I started on my lift out. It's just sitting right there with some C clamps holding it. Um, it will lift this way as you can see. Um, and I have a space I'm going to put a bridge in here. Just I just have that sitting in there so you can see how it's going to work. But that's going to be my lift out so that I don't have to duck underneath this thing. Uh, show you a little bit train running if I can here um, I have switches here so that I can power up this thing you should hear it kick on here in a second there you go this is going to be my street running once I get things done, I, and as you saw in the last video, that's where the street will be. So I'll stop that one. Throw a switch over here. And See, I have the DCC working. I don't have any of these engines programmed yet. So, 
That's why I'm stopping each one or throwing the switch because I don't have them programmed yet. Here we go. I mean, I forgot to shut the other one off, so they're going to pass each other. Right there. But as you can see, I'm making some headway. So, let's get this thing turned back around. <laughs> it's coming together, you all. Maybe by then I'll have this video stuff mastered to be doing better. But I wanted to show you what I'm doing in the room. Pretty happy with the way things are going. Wish I was a little bit further with more track laid, but it's coming. It's slowly coming, and I'm feeling good about it, like I said, because the last time I really wanted to get that ceiling painted, and I stopped, and I got this thing painted. So I have the room, um, the space, pretty much the way I wanted. I've got the room insulated. One thing I'm going to do, I was going to run some duct work out here from the house, but I think I'm going to make this room... Um, this is this thing called a mini split. It will have its own temperature control. It'll probably be on the wall behind me. And I've been pricing them between twelve and fifteen hundred bucks. So year round I can keep this temperature control and it should be pretty reasonable. So until the next video, I'll catch you guys later. Hope you like the updates. Let me know what you think. See ya.